Namaste, kings and queens. Thank you so much for gracing my channel. Your presence is such a present. So it's only right that I reciprocate you with the gift of guided messages. I'm sending you all peace, healing, love, and prosperity. Also health and wealth. Before we hop into this reading, please make sure you like, share, comment, and subscribe, please. Ooh. Hit that bell so you're notified every time I upload a beautiful reading. <clears throat> this is going to be for new love coming in for the Earth signs, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. Let's see what's coming in for you all in new love. If you're new to my channel, welcome. I appreciate you. And if you are returning, welcome back, spiritual family. We in this thing. All right. So let's see. What do we have for the earth signs, Holy Spirit, universe, source? Earth signs, please. Oh, y'all cards keep falling. Mmm. I keep on falling. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know. With you. Hmm. I'm getting some back and forth energy, all right? Or um, I feel like there's someone who you've been dealing with, all right, that it probably has never gotten to the point to where it can, like, really be a relationship, okay? This person, you've been in and out of their life or they've been in and out of your life, Um but we do have worth waiting for. We have retreat and then we have unrequited. So divine timing is at work in your love life. All right. So the divine is definitely working in your favor. All right. You are protected in regards to receiving a divine partner. All right. But at this time, it's time to disconnect from the world, earth sign. So some of you could be going in hermit mode or some of you guys could be just um, unplugging from social media or just kind of just pulling away from certain energies. Um, yeah, we have unrequited love here. All right. I'm also getting that energy because I did see pay attention to the red signs or the red flags. I'm sorry. So I feel like some of you are pulling back from um, an unrequited love or unrequited relationships here. All right. Um, you're just noticing things that you probably didn't pay attention to before and you're and you're pulling away from those things more early on. I, I see that here for you. Let's see. Why is unrequited here? Unrequited love here. Girl talk, time with friends, moving on, happily single, living, living in the moment, having fun. All right. So it's like we have retreat here and then we have a girl talk. So I'm getting this energy as definitely retreating from this unrequited love and going out with your friends. All right. Getting some much needed girl time, some me time. All right. Have a little fun. I feel like that's what's coming in for you. I feel like in being out with your friends and being in a like serendipity energy or in the energy of just having fun and enjoying the moment, um, you could meet your divine person or you're just allowing that energy in energetically for this person to become or to come closer to you. Why is retreat here? Wow. All right, we have lightning, sudden change, shocking news, surprise, um, an epiphany, a transformation. So I feel like in unplugging earth signs or you know, um, in retreating or disconnecting from the world, you're going to get some type of epiphany. All right. You're, there's going to be a transformation, um, that you go through while in this retreat or in this, um, in this moment of disconnect here, I feel like you're going to get some type of epiphany. Yeah. Heartbreak came out deeply hurt, sad separation, breakup, Grieving, all right. Some of you could definitely be suffering or going through a heartbreak at this time, and this came as shocking news to you, all right. There was a sudden change that has taken place, all right. 
I feel like for you in regards to new love, earth signs, there's just a need to just sit with you, sit with self, all right, retreat, definitely self-reflect. I'm definitely getting hermit energy here, Virgo, divine timing, because I feel like you're going to need this retreat time or this time of being a recluse um, to allow your person to come in. We have karmic relationship, feeling triggers, turmoil, resentment, letting go and loving you. So I feel like there was somebody who you waited for, um, who you thought was your divine partner and you thought was sent to you divinely and they end up being a karmic. And with the letting go and loving you, like that's giving me the energy of this retreat. Give me one more for a karmic relationship or worth waiting for. Stabbed in the back. Heartbreak, pain, separation, deception, shocking attack here. So again, we have shocking attack twice or shocking news here. So I'm getting this person is not worth waiting for. You need to move forward. You need to let this go. You need to retreat. You need to totally ghost whoever this is. This is not new love. This is past love for sure. This is something you're currently going through. Why is girl talk here? Heart with key. And we have acts. Welcoming love. Meeting the one. Open your heart. Getting together. Perfect. Yeah. So I feel like you're going to be chatting it up with your girls in regards to new love coming in or just you know, talking about how you want to meet new love and how you want to welcome new love in. But then we have acts here in reverse, breakup, separation, stop the pattern, attachment or abandonment. So it's like somebody here, either you or your person, this unrequited love or this karmic relationship, somebody doesn't want to let this go, but you're being guided to. Let's see, Holy Divine Spirit. Give me energy for new love for the earth sign. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, please. Give me energy, please, for my earth signs in regards to new love coming in. What's coming in for them? New love, new love. Ace of Pentacles. All right, that's beautiful. All right stability all right commitment Ooh, the full car so this is definitely going to be a new person okay i feel like this is going to be a new beginning wow and then we have the six of wands this is going to be something that is very much successful i feel like you're going to be able to take this um take this and run with it i'm hearing okay i feel like you guys are going to be giving each other a lot of attention this is going to be something new fresh vibrant all right um very happy energy i feel like both uh this person coming in could be an aries um or any fire sign or any earth sign like yourself i feel like this person coming in wow they offer a a, a sense of like just newness a sense of being free a sense of being you know able to live your life i'm getting a lot of travel with this person coming in we have the page of wands here and with the ace of pentacles six of wands all right i feel like you guys you're gonna be encountering somebody where um you can travel with this person try new things new restaurants um um i'm also getting like introduce each other to like just different things like and you have the means to do that i'm also getting the energy of just like spoiling each other rotten mm -hmm. why is the six of wands here the six of wands is giving me the energy of whoever this is new coming in they're they're very free spirit they're emotionally available three of pentacles here for the six of wands all right um I do feel like they do get attention from a lot of people. They're very sought after. Yeah, Ace of Pentacles. This person has got it going on, but I feel like with the Three of Pentacles in reverse, all right, they they don't want to deal with that. They don't want to deal with drama. No, yeah. 
two of pentacles the ace of cups like they want to give love to you they want to offer you this love this cup all right they're not playing games that they're not in the business of juggling all right i feel like this person coming towards you if they they feel like if they need to do that they're going to just be single they're not going to get in the relationship to hurt somebody why is the full card here this new beginning this is this is a new beginning, a new start. Yeah, Ace of uh, Page of Pentacles here. They might be younger than you. This could be a younger Earth sign or a younger Fire sign here. All right, um, Seven of Wands here. You may you may deny this person or you may block this person initially because of their age. Like, boy, you still way behind the ears, or girl, you you not on my level. You're not ready for this. But I feel like they 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 are they are why is the ace of pentacles here for new love yeah the eight of wands they're not going to give up on you all right whoever this is especially if it's a fire sign like they're going to keep coming for you they're going to keep um trying to take you out they're going to keep sending you messages all right we got the ace of swords they're being guided to do this okay this person is being sent to you i feel like this person um kind of likes the rejection they already know they already know eventually you're going to give in why is that a uh, page of wands here this person knows you're going to give in all right we have the hangman they came out in the struggle position here could be dealing with the pisces um give me one more yeah the sun card <laughs> could be dealing with the pisces with um leo in their chart or you're dealing with the leo with pisces in their chart um Give me one more for the the hangman in the sun card here. Four of wands. Wow. So I feel like this person is going to, um, th they may finally like pull back from you. Like, okay, you want to block me. You want to reject me. You don't want to take all this love and light and this good ass energy I'm giving you. Okay, I'm going to pull it away. But they're going to pull it away because they want, they want you to come towards it. They want... They want you to realize, like, I feel like this person really, really hits you with a lot of good energy and in a short amount of time. And it, it's going to leave you, like, thinking about them if you don't hear from them for, for a while. I'm also getting the energy of two... This person, okay, this is for some of you. Everybody won't resonate with this, but this person coming in, they could be dealing with um, a Leo or in a, in a relationship with a Leo. It doesn't have to be that sign, but with the sun card and the four of wands, this person might retreat and go back to like their old relationship. So for some of you with the two of wands, they might be juggling something here for some of you. But for, for most of you, as far as new love, I see this person who is coming in as um, very solid, all right? Grounded, all right? This person could be um, spiritual, all right? This person could like meditate or um, do some type of like yoga practicing or some type of practice to like keep them centered in life, period. All right, so let's get a few more cards. Let's see what Holy Spirit needs you guys to surrender in order for this new love to come in, Earth Signs. Let's see. Holy Divine Spirit, provide me energy for my Earth Signs. What do they need to surrender in order to allow this new love coming in here? And for that last, uh, that last spread, that's only for a few of you. So if you do block this person for some of you, okay, and they go back to their spouse or to their home or whatever, um, it was a good thing that you blocked them. But for others of you, I feel like this person is trying to bring you in a stable commitment and pure love with the Ace of Cups and the Ace of Pentacles here twice. All right. Um with the full card they definitely want to start a new beginning with you all right so we have surrender to resentment and that's what this bullshit right here this unrequited love 
Holding on to resentment only poisons you. Try to forgive others for their shortcomings and keep moving forward towards positive situations in your life. Boom. All right. Let's get one more. Ooh. I don't know why fire signs reading was so long, you guys. Um, surrender negative thinking. You have control over your thoughts. When, when negative thoughts surface, say thank you for sharing and quickly refocus your uh, positive and quickly refocus on positive affirmation. All right. So surrender to resentment and surrender negative thinking, uh, earth sign so that you can receive this new beginning and this new love, this, this wish fulfillment. Yeah. We have the ace of pentacles, ace of wands, ace of cups. Yeah. This person coming in is beautiful. All right. With the sun card here, I see, I see this being long-term longevity Four of wands could possibly get married to this person. All right. So that's what I have for you, Earth Signs. I hope this helps. Make sure you like, share, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. I love you. Ashe.